Get to your morning headlines now. Right now, Knox County is reporting 99 COVID-19 related hospitalizations, a new record for the county. You can see the spike on the right side of the graph. The county also reports four new deaths. The state is also reporting a new record in the number of active COVID-19 cases at more than 43,000. That's more than the number of seats at Vanderbilt Stadium. Nine new COVID-19 related deaths were also reported across counties in our area. Meantime, Thanksgiving is just two days away and the CDC is recommending people don't travel for the holiday. But AAA predicts millions of Americans will be on the road anyway. You could still on some occasions be positive with the virus and have a negative test result. Doctors in Tennessee say a negative test result before you travel or gather doesn't mean you are in the clear. Here's a look at the COVID-19 incubation timeline. Let's say you're exposed to the virus. Five days later, you go in for a COVID-19 test and the results come back negative. You gather with family a few days later for Thanksgiving. Doctors say you could be contagious without symptoms and add this is when you are most contagious. It's not until day 14 after you were exposed that you could start showing symptoms. Here in Knox County, the health department says they're seeing long lines for testing ahead of the Thanksgiving holiday. 